Hello there, everyone, and welcome back to Home of the Brave Beta Mod for Hearts of Iron 4. I'm your host, Mr. Mocha Lover, of course. And we have the Minimen struggle. The Minimen are on their last legs as their militants are captured and interrogated in increasingly large numbers, and we counter their attempted raids. With the AFP propaganda being largely rooted out, farmers are more clearly are on our side of the conflict, and they can do relatively little to disrupt us. Still, their sting is felt, and we must finish the job if we're to maximize our supplies and troops' morale. Let's finish them. Great, great, great. Oh, uh, we've got quite a few comments to go through, and yeah. This is where we're at. The AFP, American Union State, is attacking us, so I figured, you know what? We don't have enough divisions. Well, I think for some of these guys, I actually made them have the last stand, because I figured they'd be strong enough. But we're also attacking over here, and as someone did point out in the comments, we need to take out the CSA pretty quickly. So we're doing the best we can. I want to take out Ohio, get to Pennsylvania, crush the federal government, and then focus all on the West. That is my main goal here in this episode. Oh, it's not looking good. Oh, the Aust did the Austrian skill and send us supplies earlier? I thought, hmm. Help out, help out, guys. You oh, and we can do our focus, too, because we just finished, a lot, like, defense stuff, or land docking. Yeah. Death from above. War college? That's not bad. We could actually use that. Let's go do that. Get a double 150% bonus for superior firepower. Our great, our war colleges throughout the ODP territory are sadly still outdated and need to be updated to focus on advancements in technology, namely artillery, and how to b properly position it. American Union State. It's just... I'm not sure what to say. Oh, they actually took a tile. That is really not good for us. That's okay. Hold and adapt. Hold and adapt. Because we're still trying to attack them down here, which is going okay-like. Oh, did they actually beat us down here? What's going on? Oh, this is not great. This is really not great. I need more divisions. We don't have anyone else we can have for divisions yet. We just, we just got Artillery Expert 2 for our guys. How much artillery do we have? Not enough. That's always the answer. Infantry divisions. If we did this, we would have barely enough to do that. We can save a few on guns. Now that's looking good. Lots of guns. If that's a case, you know what? I hate using this. We could use militia as just kind of garrison soldiers. Oh, I'd rather use these guys, actually. Because while militia... Well, yeah, honestly, I'd rather use these guys. Literally just punching bags of just men and guns. That's literally all they are. Save a bunch of guns. Well, I guess that would mean 10,000 out. Uh, let's do that. Cool. There you go. More divisions. Uh, I need to throw you on the line over here because we are not doing great right now. Uh, yeah. I mean, if we had to retreat a little bit, that's fine with me. Actually, retreating behind this area would not be bad. Oof. It's not looking good. It's really not looking good. Another, another division? Not bad. Well, I'll throw you where we need to be, really. Come on, guys. Crack them. I want to take out Ohio as fast as possible. Which is obviously not going to be good. Fighting against the car, huh? Well, if they're attacking us, we might be able to attack them right back. Uh, yes, please. One, two, three. That'd be good. More divisions. Throw them on the line. Well, they are suffering a little bit of attrition. Not that much, though, but I'll take every little bit that we can grab. Alright, so they're still trying to break down here, break down there. Louisiana's got a hold. That's like the most important thing. You guys attack as well. Last time we were able to get to Detroit, which was great. And you guys are not looking great. But you still might be able to do some work. Might do some real good things around here. You might still be able to win. How are we doing in the Deep South? We are losing quite a few planes. That is not good. Oh, come on. Don't lose, guys. Don't lose. Especially right here too. My goodness, it's just it's been, it's brutal the way they're just attacking. Over a third of a million. Oh, we've lost a lot of guys too. Mostly against the CSA though. These guys are still killing each other, which is nice to see. Uh, let's see. You guys go right there. Oh, you guys are over there. That's totally fine with me. But oh, oh, they actually took that tile. That sucks. That really sucks. Oh, we're going to get back there, though, which is good. Helps helps us out, which is nice. My cat is complaining outside. Let's see. What, oh, we actually got this tile, too. That's nice. It's very good. My apologies about that, but see. One of the comments from yesterday says, Play as a Pacific States of America with Walt Disney. Yes, I do plan on doing that eventually. Not sure when, but eventually. Oh, my goodness. Hmm... And the American Union State is very strong. I mean, they, I mean, it makes sense why they have to be. Just because they're on a two-front war right now. But still. 
Oh god. Oh, we got there just in time. Woo! Come on. I don't want to attack over there across the river. Oh, is this all river? Oh, it's so not good. Uh, they are suffering quite a bit of attrition. It's only 5%, though. Is there anything we can do around here? Well, it looks like we've got to push up in Illinois, Indiana air territory, then. <sighs> We're still just not looking that strong whatsoever. Try that. Good. War College, it would be nice. Force rotation would be good. Industrial contracts, might as well. One area where both socialists and industrialists outnumbered us was, of course, industry itself. Military and industrial contracts will help rectify this for the future. Great, great, great. It is 38. Let's grab some more defense, because we absolutely need it. Let's see. And I'll let you know, everything is still monetized for the campaign at the time of this recording, so we'll see what happens. <laughs> we'll definitely see what happens. Oh, you know what? I need to push the longest front. Yeah. Oh, we need more defense. Ooh, we can do this too. Mm, Federalists or Socialists? McNarney, McNarney plan would be looking pretty good. Let's see. Organized Socialists. Fighting for America. Scattered Minutemen. Well, organized... Well, let's put down the Red Guards for now. That'd be good. Give us a 25% bonus against these gosh darn guys. That'd be good. Okay, so we're slowly winning over here, hopefully. And if that's the case, you guys are going to help win over here, too. Now, that tank division is not going to be easy to take out. But if I can get to Chicago, that might collapse them, maybe? We'll probably take, we'll probably have to take Milwaukee as well to collapse them. Which is fine with me, but still. Yeah, I'd love to get Columbus so they have less supply points. Attacking seven divisions with three militia divisions would not be very smart. Next comment would be, Patton could become leader of the Constitutional American Republic. I don't know that. Oh man, our center line is just not looking good. Holy bad words. So go like a power every day, that's nice. You guys get over here. We just don't have any divisions to spare. St. Louis is still ours. I've been to St. Louis. I'm not really explored it too much, though. Oh, come on, guys. Hold out. Hold out. Don't give up. God dang it. Mm -hmm. And, yeah. And someone also said we should take out the Syndicus ASAP. Well, that's part of the goal. Let's see what we can do. You guys come up here. If we can circle that tank division, that'd be great. Alright. We got two divisions versus two divisions. Not good enough. But we'll throw in three in total. And really two to help support the attack. Pushing towards Chicago. That's the goal, go, go. Hopefully they take even more attrition. That would be nice. That's good. Oh. Uh, Germany, you don't need to be doing that right now. You know what? Hold the attack. The line isn't looking bad. My goal is like a rolling defense, which is what I normally actually do. You know what? If we lose this part of Arkansas, I'm not too concerned since they already have Little Rock. And that would actually be really good for us. Just hold. Just... Okay, what the heck. Alright, then both of you just kind of hang out there then. For now. Um, we're still holding out down here. But they are attacking with extreme ferocity. Anything of interest? No, does anyone else have upgrades of interest? Nope. Patton? Didn't realize Patton could become a general as well for us. So. I eh, we might as well do that one. Cool. A little more defense. That'd be nice. Oh, that is interesting. Alright. Actually, the CSA could capitulate Washington. I would not be opposed to that. I just want them to die. I want them all to die. That's all I want. Can you just please die? Oh, you're not winning down here. That's not good. They reinforce it with more infantry. Well, that's not ideal. Throw some more guys in then. Uh, you guys go in as well. You guys help out. You guys help out. Good. Good. Alright, El Salvador. Cool. And yeah, someone said Triple K. Yep, Triple K. Party the Triple K, I guess. I'm totally okay with you guys retreating, guys. It's totally okay. Even though we can't defend against an, on a hill. Oh, that is... What the heck is going on down here? Throwing that infantry. That, that's totally fine to retreat. It's not a bad thing to retreat sometimes. No, hold, hold, hold. You don't want to waste any more lives. And defending against the river is a great thing. Now you're going to send me convoys, but you already sent volunteers with these guys. You literally just beat my guys up, and you're sending me equipment? Cool. Awesome. Alright, revive nativism, absorb white caps, more infantry equipment would actually be really nice. It's currently the government at the NDWL has a very organization with regards to the various white leagues, especially for those used for subterfuge against enemies of the state. The paramilitary wings, the white league, local militias, and so on shall be officially absorbed into the NDWL or even as an arm of the government. Let's go and put weakened minimum resistance. Love it, love it, love it. We got more, a few more factories because we actually built up infrastructure quite a bit early on. Wow, we need way more guns. Holy cow. Good thing they only cost steel. More guns, more guns, more guns. Infrastructure's nice, but guns, guns, guns. For the love of God, we need more guns. Oh, 
Oh, seriously, guys, if you, you're trying to attack us here, too. Wycliffe, Draper. You know what? Go with Ambusher. Mobile defense, yes. More defense is awesome. Let's grab some dispersed support for now. Seriously, how are you losing? Oh, wait, how are you not in the battle yet? My Odorize isn't super strong, but they're not that weak. I know they're not that weak. Uh, we're still attacking up there, though. Let's see. Come on, guys. Break them. Yes, we got it. We got it. Oh, are we not winning up here either? Wow. Man, our guys are just not that strong now, are they? Now, these guys are still suffering a little bit of attrition. Not much. Charleston, I'd rather have we take it than the enemy. We, with all these guys here, this will actually help shore up the line. By shore up the line, make it a little tighter, which I love, 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 love. There you go. I mean, the Western Command is not doing well right now, which is totally fine with me, but still. Ah, oh, Russia, yes. Gladly help us out. Gladly, gladly, gladly. Don't want to attack tanks. We'll probably attack here next. Give our guys a little bit more time to get a few more guns, because we're really lacking. We're lacking a lot of artillery as well. Can you please stop attacking me here, guys. Please. Using militia is really not ideal. Quarter million losses from us. Mostly from the syndicalists. But a good a good majority of it from the uh, American Union State. It doesn't seem like we've killed enough American Union State manpower, though. Nationals victory in South Africa. Well, good luck. Well, good job with that, I guess, guys. Hey, we got Charleston. Nice. Ooh, does that... Yes, West Virginia. Yes, please. All right. This side is looking quite ideal now, I would say. They're still suffering more attrition, probably because they can't get enough supplies through there. Thank you, Russia. Please do a great job. Uh, I'll leave you guys here. State of Ukraine has joined the... Oh, my goodness. They willingly join, huh? Well, good luck, Ukraine. They're probably going to need it. They're still attacking us down here. Alright, these guys are next, probably. Oh, well, maybe not. Maybe we could get over the river first and attack from the north. Actually, even encircle them. Uh, send the infantry in, because they're pretty strong. Send one militia division. If we can circle these five divisions, that'd be great. If either one wins, we can help each other out. So that, I like that a lot. Don't let him move. No, no, no. There you go. There you go. Take out. If you can take Columbus, that's even less uh, victory points for them, which would be awesome. Good. Looking a little better here. Good. 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 Come on. More divisions. Nice. The Illinois-Idaho National Guard. I thought that was West Virginia we were supposed to get. Oh well, whatever. Now put the line down here, maybe. Doesn't really matter to me too much. Absorb the Whitecaps. Oh, there they are. Okay, okay so we just got some random divisions. I'll, I'll take it. I'll take it. Absorb the Whitecaps. Kinship economics. More daily political power. Consumer goods factories goes down by 2%. Get a few more building slots. Civilian factories minus zero. Sure. Only through shared sacrifice can our people hope to become united. Kinship economics emphasizes generational family-owned businesses, as well as finding fellow, favoring fellow whites in our tax codes and property laws. Very good. Gotta keep an eye on... Oh, that motorized is not looking too happy, I'd say. Send in the militia. I'll keep the infantry there, because they will probably won't be able to uproot those guys. I'm sure the American Union States has got a lot of manpower. Yeah, they got a lot of manpower left. CSA's got a bunch of stuff left. They actually have less than 100 divisions, which is good to see, but I'm not too concerned about that. Hey, we did it. I knew we could do it. Immediately begin. Attacking over river is just so god-awful, but it's so necessary right now. Kill them. We don't have time to waste. And then you guys come to Columbus, too. Come on, destroy those six militia divisions. They're literally just guys with guns. Which is fine with me, but still. Come on. Yes. Yes. Oh, we got Columbus. And we basically just killed those guys off. Love it. 20. Oh, this is going down. So I gotta keep an eye on this side. Looking good. Looking real okay. Next up is Cleveland. Uh, I think I've driven through Cleveland once. Maybe. Oh, we don't even need to support them here, huh? Alright, you guys help attack. Send the infantry in to help out too. Help them, help them, help them. Good, good, good. Uh, so that's kind of questionable actually out there. Up them out. Send the infantry in. The good old infantry. Ah, okay, that's seven divisions. That's quite a few. Convoy's lost. It was sunk. Good. Looking not too bad. Have you guys retreat and they get a slight amount of experience points. American. Push against... Oh, that's not good. That's really not good for us. Pushing the federal front. Eh. 
I'm, I'm not really too concerned about the federal front too much. Okay, if we have to retreat here, that's you know what, that's fine as well. This could help close up the line a little bit more, since I'm focused on the other side. You hold, you both retreat. That's up to us defend even easier. Oh, they're attacking us down here. What the? Oh, they actually beat us here. That's not good. Brazil wins the World Cup. All right, help attack them there. They're attacking for Detroit. No, 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 sir. No Detroit for you. Yes, yes. We'll gladly accept whatever you got. Keep attacking, keep attacking. Wear them out. Wear them out. They're really attacking. Oof. Everyone really doesn't like us. What do they like us? What? Uh, let's see. Syndicalist front? That's fine. Really help us win there. Over half a million from the American Union state are dead. Very good to see. Alright, guys. Columbus is ours. Hopefully we can get a way to integrate Ohio fairly quickly. I would love to see that. They want to attack? Okay, we'll attack them too. Their militia's looking really bad. Alright, got those guys at this point. Um... You guys are 19 combo with it, which is not bad at all. So, I'm going to put you over here, because we need another army, like what we try to make with under Pat and this guy. Well, I need him. Ooh, Jeb. I like Jeb. I like Adaptable, though. Uh, he's kind of co politically connected. So, Jeb! He's going to help us crush Ohio fast. With his infantry, he should do okay. No way to scam for more uh, supplies, huh? That sucks. Ooh, are we losing there? That's not good. Ooh, this might be a really good time to take out that tank division, though. Sorry, guys. You guys are set over here. You should be fine. Kinship economics? Christian work ethic? White welfare, huh? Oh, well, okay. Then crackdown on traitors? Ooh, weaken the militia. Oh, I'll do that one. Provide nativism. The foundations of America, as the white leaguers understand, is not only our connection to the former nation of Britain, but just the blood within the Anglo-Saxons as a race. An executive act by Simmons shall illegalize interracial act by threat of death and require all marriages to occur in approved Christian churches. I mean, kind of wild, I'd say. Kind of wild. Oh, Ohio! Thank God we got Ohio. I can't believe I just said that, but, you know, whatever. Ohio can be good for some things. Like astronauts. Oh, we got Cleveland, that's why. Awesome. Go in, go in. Take the territory. Nice. Beat them up, beat them up, beat the snot out of them. Great. Oh, look at this. Oh, that's nice. What's going on? Good, okay, okay. Nice. I think I think they're kind of broken at this point. It's 1938. Let's go grab this other infantry stuff, too. Nice. More soft attack. Thank you. All right, so from Cleveland, you guys attack out here. And then you three attack right here. Take Jab with you. And tally ho! Oh, they're still taking up. Oh, well, Germany went to war with Lithuania, huh? That's okay. Very odd, but whatever. Uh, I'm gonna sit, just tell you guys don't leave. You guys stay up here. Revolt in the Reichs Pact? Ah, that's why I had. That's why they did that. Revolt! Red Arrow Division? Well, three divisions is good enough. I'm just gonna throw you guys over here then. That's fine. Actually, I told you to retreat. And you're still holding out. Okay, you know, if they can, if they can hold out, that's fine with me. Uh, if we have to cut down these guys a little bit, so be it. Hopefully we have enough guns for all that stuff. Okay, so now we're looking really lacking here. Wow. The way this is set up is really bad. <laughs> you might be able to crush these guys over here. Can the U.S. government, like, take away their ports? Please take away their ports. You guys attack there. I'm going to have you guys just go here and just circle them. Because while we're not doing great down here, so be it. Disperse the support. Oh, wait. Overwhelming. Oh, wait. I'm supposed to go integrate support. Oh, I always I always go that way. You know what? I never go this way. Let's go. keep going this way. Overwhelming's firepower. It's, it's definitely not work as good as the other one, but you know what? I almost never go down that way. We might as well go down that way, right? Might as well. Oh, Pittsburgh. Let's get Pittsburgh. Go, 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 go. Good. More defense. More breakthrough. I love it. Next up, military police. Could be, how much support equipment do we have? Actually, we have an okay amount. Oh, we're on export focus. So we need to go to limited exports, but whatever. It's 38 still. We could get some radar. We got the research done. Extraction. 
some more air doctrine because we have a bonus towards all that stuff right now, which is good to use when you have it, right? Right. Now you're defending, which is fine, but I need you to help attack. Oh, we got Pittsburgh. That's so good. Mole steel. Oh, that militia. Yes, please help that line out. Please help the line. Oh, these guys chose very poorly. It's only one military division to kill off, but hey, it's better than better dead than red. <laughs> and someone got over here. That's fine. Are they still attacking? They're still attacking over here. American Union State is probably really tuckered out now, with just nothing but attacks. Then again, I could say the same thing about these guys too. Real tuckered out. Oh, we lost a convoy. That's not good. Don't not, don't do that area. Actually, what are we using for garrison divisions? Cavalry? Oh, that's not bad. That's really not bad. Alright, cool. Isn't there a little modifier? Like, after you hold a safe for a while, like, you get it integrated eventually, right? War propaganda. We're already okay with... Oh, why do we leave Pittsburgh? What the heck? Don't leave Pittsburgh. Don't leave the Steel City. Oh, I don't know. I'm sure if it's called Steel City, but I kind of like that idea. Alright, we head on up here, and then attack down there. Or actually just go there first, and then come over here. Just go straight that way. There you go. How we doing? How we holding? Ooh, we are losing some ground to these guys over here, but this is part of the plan. Just don't lose Detroit. Revive natalism after that we'll crack down on traitors. A group of stubborn clansmen that refuse to reveal, reveal their names have come to Simmons seeking exception. Our chief Simmons has made an enlightened decision to the issue and sent the clansmen into the Secret Service. With the portion of the clansmen still undercover, we will be able to seek out and eliminate those with reservations against us. Well, alright, why not? Close the Pennsylvania pocket. Did I just say no, oh, well, actually, yeah, well. It's alright, you guys are doing okay anyways. Not too concerned about that. Just keep holding on, sons. Oh, now they're really attacking with a renewed vigor. Oh, that's fine, yeah, come on in. We still leave. Why do we leave Pittsburgh completely undefended? What the heck? Guys, seriously, just... God dang it, you piece of garbage. Why do you disobey orders? Why do you leave it open? You ding-dongs. Yeah, ding a wings. It's only one division. We can break over here. We cut all these guys off. Nope. You're not getting cut us. Getting us cut off. No, 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 no. Attack red guard cells. Yes, please. All right. So we couldn't quite win there. That's fine. God, I hope the federal government government can collapse soon enough. Oh, the western command is gone. Good to see that. You guys go over there. Ohio National Guard. Save some uh, manpower. Or, or, I don't really care about manpower. Federal cells badly wounded. The federal militias and legions in our territory are on the last legs. By our counterattacks, which have left them increasingly unorganized and looking more like true militias than a military. Some of them they are ill-suited for. This has given our intelligence wing and patrols much needed relief and leaves the feds in a position to be finished off. Keep it at bay then. You know what? We need intelligence agency. We got enough... Oh, look at that. That looks really cool. Because I want some some spies who can help us down a lot of resistance. Get back, Pittsburgh. It's a shame that you allowed Pittsburgh to refall into red hands. How dare you? Oh, we cut them off. They're completely cut off here. That's so good. Immediately begin attacking. They have no supplies. Zero supplies. Oh, that is not good right here, too. Get your butts in there, boys. Where are our ships? Where are you? Can't you not see that our convoys are dying? There you go. Oof. Find those American submarinos or those fed subs. We'll call them fed subs. Oh, we got these back. That's good. Oh, we got them. Kill them off. Kill them off. Kill them off. Kill them off. There we go. We lost the convoy, but at least we were kind of protecting ourselves a little bit. Help out. Help out. Crush these eight divisions. Oh, my goodness. Another four are going to die here as well. Awesome. Ukraine. I love the Ukraine. It's time to start beating up some fed, some feds. Hmm. Talking about real life or what? Someone was wounded, so be it. Anyone else have upgrades? McNarney? Yes. Yes. Be good. Anything else? No. 
And no. A lot of green, a lot of green. As long as green number goes up, I'm feeling pretty darn good. Alright, you boys. Head on over. I want to get New Jersey. Uh, actually, you guys go over here like this. And plow through them if you can. Help out. Just go and do it. And you just go straight across. Go to, go to New York City. We can go there. That'd be great. Awesome. Awesome. Legacy of no nothings. Ooh, lose monthly population. Get some recruitment population. Fact that looks pretty good. Clan oath. Black. Mm. Ooh, I, I might wait to do some of that stuff. I don't want to piss off the, the people from the Black Republic or whatever. So, um, how about an air force? Formation of an air force with an ongoing debate in the U.S. Army, spanning for nearly two decades, continues. Still, the Air Army Air Corps, the Air Corps officers that defected to our side, have promised us great results if we separate the branch from the army. The Constitutional American Air Force shall be formed, and we'll have to decide its future plans. Order. There we go. That's what I was wondering when that was going to come by. Order restored in Ohio. Over the past few weeks, American government forces have been busy in Ohio, arresting those we feel would prove a hindrance to our control and helping our local supporters spreading the good word amongst the people. We want to reassure them that, as American citizens, they have no reason to fear our presence. Our efforts shall slowly begin to bear fruit, even in the midst of all this chaos. Beautiful. Absolutely beautiful. We get all their factories, all the Ohioans going to be with us forever. Forever and ever. Actually, we're doing really good on guns now. Wow, that is awesome, awesome, awesome. We need more tungsten because I'm going to build a buttload of uh, artillery as well. Buttload of this, buttload of that. I'm not sure why I say buttloads, but no. There's going to be a large amount. Oh, we have to contend with the federal government, the feds. Oh, I don't want to deal with the feds. Then again, who does? We might be able to win over here. It's going to be very costly, but... We still might be able to win, maybe, maybe not. Oh, we're no longer pushing against the syndicalists. Um, well, that sucks. You guys still might be able to win. I don't know. Let's see what happens. Republican Bureau of Investigation, huh? Let's do any partisan stuff. I don't want to deal with that much resistance, to be honest with you. Oh, Argentina! I love this in Oh, that's not Argentina. Central American Republic. I love the Central American Republic. Some of our best buds, you know, best buds. Oh, uh, we're looking over here. Not that strong, but we're managing to hold out. The PSA is slowly coming our way. Which has gotten me a little... I'd say concerned, maybe? Maybe not too much. Oh, there's some Brazilians over there, too. If we could take New York City, that'd be so good. The federal government, that's going to be a pain in the butt to take out. Up to 45 divisions, less than 100,000 manpower. We lost another convoy. That sucks. Gosh darn it. What are we paying? Oh, wait. Oh, that, we actually lost a couple of destroyers. That's not good. Oh, we lost all of our ships. All of our screens. Well, that is god awful. Focus more on screens then for now. There you go. Not bad, not bad. Could be a lot, lot worse. So much worse, actually, it could be. You lose it, I'm not too concerned. Can't win there, I'm not too concerned. You attack there? Uh, I'm not really that concerned either. You guys can attack here though. I know these guys can win here. Support from all sides. Oh yeah, let's do this too. Push on the federal front finally. And we can minimum resistance? Yes, please. Head of intelligence? That would not be actually be a bad thing to have. Federal government is gonna have to collapse. Oh look at that, that's not good. Repair, 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 repair. Oh man, we are not looking good down here. We've definitely hurt those tanks, though, which is really nice, though. Um, Fighters, Limburg. Yeah, this stuff is okay. I'm going to go with Wayland Reform Plan. Otto P. Wayland managed to reach the higher echelons of command recently due to a mix of both nepotism and skill, and has proposed a reform plan which is clearly welcomed by the Army leadership. In his view, the Air Force's role in war should be able to support the Army's advances via close air support. While the theoretical approach is sound, the final decision rests with the government. Very good. You keep up the struggle with those guys. Uh, I say keep up the struggle. Don't don't give up on the struggle. You still might be able to actually do well here. Take all of West Virginia back. Oh, you guys are doing okay. Yeah, there you go. Alright, it has gone to war with itself. Very nice. Good job, Italy. My gosh, Huey Long Dong. What you up to? Jonas Evans, counterintelligence. Uh, we'll do that one because you have two guys. There you go. Oh, they're really spying on us. But I want to put down resistance up here. Louisiana? No, actually, we're doing okay in some areas. 
I'm kind of okay with whatever we have, so... No? I'd say do some counterintelligence. Maybe we can find some spies and we can poke them and hurt them. Any partisan stuff? Passive defense? Why not? Alright, three American divisions going to be kind of tough to crack. That's alright. You guys help out right there. Come on. How can we not win here? I, my main concern is just to destroy those tanks. If they have no tanks, that's really good for us. Overwhelming firepower, that's nice. Let's grab some mechanized offensives. Uh, mm, three divisions is still pretty good. Put you guys down there if you can. Holy goodness. Nice. Get more soft attack, it's almost 39. Yeah, let's go and get some better artillery. Since we already have a nice little stockpile of it. Plenty of guns, too. Plenty of guns. Yes, please. Actually, what happens if for our garrisons, we threw on some engineers? That would actually really help us out. There you go. Now, we're not going to have enough to hold everything, but that's alright. I don't care about the cost. I want those tanks destroyed. Wow, it disappears. That's nice. Oh, this is over a river, too. I didn't realize that. Oof. It's not good. Yeah, it's not going to go well. I said hold, didn't I? Oh, you were part of that group, huh? It's alright. And that's the case. We'll attack down here, then. We'll take out Washington first. Oh boy, we're actually going to lose it finally. We did lose it, wow. It's alright, no worries. Oh, down here, I'm a little worried about this though. Don't let him in, don't, oh, did, why did you let him in? Don't just even go over, they just, just kill them. That is such a good spot to defend with, or maybe not attack. Uh, go grab this one, more ground support might as well. Push those pieces of garbage out. Wayland land reform, cool. Let's get some more daily arm XP, air XP. We were lucky enough that the American Army in the past relegated air officer training in the Deep South as we now possess access to the installations and officers from the Air Corps Tactical School in Maxwell Field, Alabama. However, in order to surpass the school set up in Langley Field at Virginia, we need to expand our honor installations. That'd be good. Now they're attacking us, huh? Did you guys make it down here yet? No, you barely made it already. Uh, they have two divisions, passive defense, even more passive defense. That'd be good. Federal government's gonna be like a rock we gotta kill. Ugh. Come on, we've gotta crack these guys. So, actually, once American Union State collapses, we will have a much bigger area to move through here and meet up with the PSA. And by meet up, I mean I have to kill off. I've left the CSA alone because I, we've gotta get this done. Like, come on. The feds refuse to attack. I hope they realize that they do have to attack besides just here, eventually. Because they have literally no legitimacy with MacArthur there. Anyone else have upgrades yet? Yes, you do. But not much there. Eh, move a little bit faster if you can. It's fine with me. Oh, the tanks are dead. Almost dead. That's good. Just know we're really good to attack. I mean, we could try here, but it's not going to do anything for us. Yeah, I mean, it, it, it's god-awful here. It's so god-awful. Would the feds actually do something? No. I'm just going to let the PSA take these guys out. There's no point. Oh. Oh, they already lost Dallas. Alright, so be it. You know what? How have we, been, how have we not won this yet? Seriously. Kill those tanks. Just move in. Thank you. Why did it take so long? We lost half a million. Alright. Brazil doing the Reichs Pact. Well, they should be supporting us then, not these other, you know, fraudsters. Uh, let's see. We're not going to win, but you got to win. I, mean, I don't care what happens. You die fighting or you just give up. Federal government's too strong. They got more manpower than before. Screw it, I'm not going to focus on these guys then. 
This is a waste of time. Complete waste of time. If that's the case, who's actually over here? What armies are actually over here? Not you. Over here. Half you guys, come over here. Uh, I'm not going to do that to you guys or you guys. Who's this army up here? Army 4? I need you. You're going to help just surround the entire area. Because I'm going to focus on the CSA. To hell with the federal government. If they want to win the war, then they have to come to me. I'm going to take out the CSA first. I should have focused on them more and more and more and more and more. But nope. I thought we could take out Pennsylvania and the federal government. Nope. Just the garbage they are. Let's see. The army's request for more ground support while traversing the trenches. Our enemies have erected. As an equal partner, the Air Force approves this request. Alright, Jeb, you get to where you need to be. Because I'm... Oh, I'm sorry. If you'd like to read about this, go right ahead. Uh, sure. Why not? We get another operative slot, if I remember correctly. You guys are almost done. Are you guys moved in yet? It looks like they are. Good. All right, to hell with the federal government. They want to spend their time doing that crap. All right, so be it. We're pulling out. Yeah, you're not going to die here. Well, actually, you might die here because you refuse, you know, to win. So, who the hell abandoned Detroit? Oh, my God. Hey, I... Uh, you know what? Screw this. Defensive front lines. There you go. Hold everyone. Hold everyone. And let them do what they need to do to go where they need to go. Yeah, okay. You want to attack? Come try it. Come try it, you pieces of garbage. Uh, I really don't care how much damage they really do. Because now we're going to send up the front. That's good. Are you kidding me? You can't win? Uh, CSA, I hate the CSA so much. No, I don't even attack over the river. All right, you want to attack, boy? All right, let's let's see what you got. I don't like it that how the CSA and the AUS have a peace agreement still. Like that doesn't make any sense. How do they still have a peace agreement? All right, so you guys are doing well. I'm sending you guys up north. You're going to help take out. Actually, actually, huh? Maybe we'll straight for Chicago. The hell with these guys. You're not, you're not going to lose this battle. No way, son. No, 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 no. Man, the feds are pathetic. Look at that. Oof, they're not doing anything. And so are ships. What the heck? Okay, we get them here long enough to keep them busy. Seriously? Now the CSA is doing well. No wonder that you guys told me to take them out earlier. I thought I could take out Pennsylvania, but no. Yeah, seriously. The federal government is... MacArthur's extremely pathetic. He's not doing anything except a minor attack. Are you kidding me? Extremely pathetic. You guys should be able to hold... Thank goodness for that, the PSA, but that are going to be a pain to take out, too. An absolute pain. Rush it. Air support. Ground air combat exercises, uh, combat coordination exercises. And in order to come out in the battlefield with an effective CAS Air Force, we need to first practice the ballistics of basics of this relatively new concept of warfare. I mean, this is ridiculous. Like, I've never heard of the CSA and the American Union State piecing out. That is just stupid. Yeah, it looks like three American subs. That's good. Three Fed subs. Come on, MacArthur, do something. Alright, I mean, if you want to waste your lives, go right ahead. Oh, crap, Detroit. Oh, we're probably going to lose Detroit. So be it, whatever. They're going to lose Chicago anyway, so. Low echelon support. Uh, let's grab some better guns, maybe. That'd be good. Uh, it sucks we lost Detroit. That really, really sucks. But we didn't even have Zakori yet, so. Just hold on for now. You know what? You want to retreat? Retreat. Make it line a little bit more defensible. And we've got to be killing thousands of CSA members right now. Oh, hello. Well, at least that's good to get rid of those guys. We're going to go shock and still. That's still very good to do. Hey, two more American subs. Go bye-bye. I'm happy with that. 
Chicago's. We gotta go for Chicago. Force the attack. We gotta go now, 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 now. Good. You keep these guys in place. Do not let up. I don't really care. Either win or lose. Win or die. That's all you can do. Lost a convoy. And they're not they're not even pushing against these guys that much. I mean seriously, the feds are just pathetic. Now that we can keep the guys playing too. This could be better. Uh, engineers is good. We'll do some of that. And grab some support over there we go. Now we can make you guys even stronger. And you know what, we'll make them 40 combat with, why not? We don't even have tanks. Not yet, at least. Uh, let's see. Actually, that's six. That's probably too much. Oopsie. Okay, 40 combat with. High priority, high, high, high priority. Seriously, CSA? Seriously? The American Union State's about to collapse, which is not good, because I'm uh, concerned about these guys. 103 divisions. Well, hopefully, actually, when these guys collapse, the CSA is going to get bushwhacked by these guys, hopefully, so. No, you're not going to lose here. To hell with that idea. Either win or die. And if you die, so be it. Air ground coordinations. Cool. And we'll do some flexible bombers. Uh, it's okay, yeah, why not? Since our Air Force is the task of supporting the Army, the bombers of our Air Force will have to adapt to a variety of roles, both as close air support as well as disrupting enemy supplies and communications in the rear during a battle, which we should encourage the development of planes that may fulfill these roles, and I'll be right back. All right, everyone, and we're back. So, this is not where we left off. My apologies. Um, this is pretty much after we capitulated the American Union state. Uh, with the American Union state, I gave pretty much all the territory to the Pacific States of America. I gave nothing, nothing to the Western Command because I don't think they deserve it with the PSA pretty much rolling them over. Uh, let's see, I gave him portions of pretty much everything you saw, even including Iowa. Uh, I did fight them for the rest of Missouri and Arkansas and Louisiana. Um, so yeah, and then with the PSA, g having a border with the CSA has actually helped us out probably the most we I could have imagined. Just because, as you can see, well, the CSA isn't doing so well anymore. So, I've also done quite a few focuses. Um, I'll show you the ones we've done. Uh, of course, we, we started this one you know, before the fade, out, fade in. Flexible bomber development as well, which is really cool. And we also combine uh, arms offensives. And then bomb development. I can't remember exactly which ones we have or not. Uh, the reason why I don't show you guys everything is because I don't have infinite time. And it takes a while for me to process videos. So an hour video takes at least an hour and a half, hour 45 minutes to process. And if I upload three or four times a day, I don't have enough time to make that many videos. So, regardless. Oh, we've done this one. I've already done the American Navy one, too. So, we don't have any carriers. So, I like base strike, trade interdiction, great white fleet. Uh, battleship research, naval aviation. I like naval aviation, but I think we'll, I think I do want to go carriers, actually. Let's go carrier fleet projection. Carriers are the way of the future. We should invest in the research and construction to better project naval power. So, as you can tell over here, nothing's really gone over here as well. I mean, we've just been holding out. And the CSA still owns Philadelphia. Now, apparently, the federal government, oh... Hello. Um, they've taken other states or other things. Oh my goodness, that is not good for us. Uh, they've taken Harrisburg, they still have Baltimore, but I'm actually really disappointed in the federal government, as I saw, said before. Well, the PSA is not too bad. Uh, here's the casualties. We have a lot of divisions. It doesn't mean they're good, they're actually pretty garbage. But with the CSA and the Pacific states killing each other, I mean, that's, that's not bad. Actually, the PSA has got a lot of factories. Who are the most? But, yeah, I'm sorry I didn't show you guys everything I would have preferred to, but sometimes I just gotta take a break from the computer, so. And I can't show you guys everything, but it's time for us to get Chicago out. Oh my goodness. Because, like, at the time of this recording, I'm also playing Victoria 2, and the day I'm making this recording, it took me like three hours to play Vicky 2, so. <clears throat> sometimes I, you just gotta take a break from the computer. And that's what I did. I took a little break. And we have Chicago. Thank God. I. Thank God for the PSA. Like, holy crap. Thank goodness for the PSA. Actually, do they have a... I did take it back to Troy as well. So that was actually really nice. But... 
it is, of course, the Super Force. And actually, let me show you the world, because the world's gone to crap. So here's the Entente, of course. And through international Mexico, the Reichstag, Brazil, fighting off Paraguay. Or Uruguay, that's Uruguay. Paraguay is this one over here. Yeah, that's Paraguay. Cool. The Entente and the Reichspack, they're actually working together from the little event I saw. So they're working together. Um, Austria's not looking so well. Are They're fighting the po Poles? What? And, Russia, and Germany's fighting a two-front war. And Spain's in a civil war. And Italy's killing itself, so. What else is new? Um... Alright, well, I'll take more divisions, yeah. I'll, I'll love divisions. Take them, take them, take them. Illinois, thank you very much. Uh, guys, could you please not lose? That would be great if you just chose not to lose. That would be so good. Now... Oh, I guess... Wow, I have... We've been long war for so long, I've been able to build up all the roads around here. For the most part. Wow. Alright, whatever. Yeah, it's been... It's been a while. I'm not really sure what else to say. I mean, I'd love to take out the federal government, but I have a better chance of taking out the PSA than the federal government, probably. So, uh, give me one moment, please. My cat is once again outside demanding my attention. My apologies. The CSA. Oh, the CSA. Oh, the federal government. Oh, you guys. Well, I mean, the feds aren't looking too good. I assume it's because, like, the CSA, I mean, they've been really gung-ho about killing everybody. Um, we've killed off a lot of them. I mean, almost a million dead because of them. It's ridiculous. They really want Chicago. So do I. Um, that's why we took it. And we've been develop developing our intelligence as well, so. Alright, it looks like they've abandoned the area. Um, CSA? What's going on? Thank. Oh, we're order store in West Virginia. If you like to read about this, go right ahead. Thank God for uh, the PSA. Just, oh my goodness. Okay, feds, please. Please stop this. Please. Please stop your tyranny. Uh, we need way more support equipment. I forget exactly. I can't even remember. I'll be honest. I make so many videos, I can't even remember what I did. So, what do we have here? Oh, they're attacking us down there. That's fine. I made some of these guys a little bigger. Yeah, with the garrisons, I made these 20 combo with. We got some support artillery. These guys have some more support equipment. And yeah, that, that costs quite a bit. Militia here. Uh, car stuff. I think these guys are the garrison template. What are, what are we even doing here? It's almost 19, It's almost 1940. Wow. We're going to go and grab some more of this. Some more soft attack. I like soft attack. You guys are doing a great job. So. Oof. Warfare is a little tiring. Carlos Brewer. Okay, they clear one of them, so that means the PSA does not get Japanese volunteers, which is very, very nice. Illinois Militia, very good, very, very good. Uh, we might need more divisions around here. That's not ideal. Red Guards on the last legs. The Red Guard Militia has been seen blow after blow, and are forced to resort to their more base tactics of ever more basic industrial sabotage and worker recruitment, as they lack almost any ability to coordinate amongst each other, and workers are overwhelmingly unwilling to join their cause, even passively. Appears we may be win this fight after all. Not bad, not bad. Not batterinos. Yeah, the PSA or the CSA. Yeah, if that when that happens, when when you go to war with them, you really just call it. Got to call in the PSA. I mean, they don't have that many divisions. They don't have that much manpower. They got a buttload of fuel, but like with Reed here, oh, there's but Andy's Union. Um, that really helped us out. So MacArthur... Oh, he's got no manpower. Look at that. I mean, I don't understand how these guys have not given up yet. I mean, they're actually looking better than before. Whew. Happy 1940, everyone. Hope you're having a great year. This is the year that will definitely kill off the CSA. Definitely, definitely, definitely. Oh, it's 1940. Let's grab some better artillery. Might as well, right? Yeah. So, I I'm assuming Milwaukee is the last major victory point. Because, I mean, the you have the Upper Peninsula here. Minnesota's already gone. I'm not really sure what else they could do here. Like, other victory points. Because they're pretty much screwed over now. Oh, god dang it. You pieces of garbage. We'll deal with 
from the federal. I'm gonna I'm gonna murder the federal government after this. Okay, okay. I know the CIA or the FBI or the NSA is listening in. I'm not gonna do it in real life yet. Just, <laughs> but I'm gonna in in this game. I am gonna make sure we get rid of these guys. All right. You know what? Let's get rid of the Milwaukee. Just just get rid of them. Kill off the CSA. King of Finland is gone. Goodbye, Finland. Help them out. Go, 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 go. Passive defense. Blueprint stealing. That'd be very nice. Help them out. Help out these guys. Now, the reason I'm not attacking any other provinces is most because I like the entrenchment, first of all. And secondly, even though we could probably do pretty well, I want to focus on one state at a time. Especially like, well, I guess technically we already got the soldiers for Illinois. Pacific, uh, we're doing with that stuff. Uh, whatever. Alright, so you guys are up here, right? Please just kill them off. You guys are doing the best you can. Are you getting it? Nah, you are getting attacked again. We've been building up more ships as well, which is good. Oh, yeah, yeah. Yeah, I'm not even going to attack yet. Jeb is cool and all. He's level 6 of defense. That's really good. Hmm. Carrier Fleet Project. Nice. Naval Aviation. Light Cruiser Development. Why not? Light cruisers are important in anti-air operations as well as attacking enemy destroyers and submarines. We should ensure our Navy is a handful of these in order to stay balanced. It's always good to be a little bit balanced. Whew. What? Where? Where? What the hell are you doing? Why are you doing that? I don't understand some... Okay, it's... oh my god, it's not Mod's fault, it's Paradox's fault for this. Why would you have a front line all the way down here? You can't frontline the river, or the, not the river, the lake. That doesn't make any sense. Just go into here. <laughs> yeah, I'm going to make, what is this, Lake Michigan? A front line? Oh my goodness, Paradox, why? Why would you make the, the lake part of the front line? <laughs> why? I mean, it's one thing, it's like one of those tiny lakes in Minnesota, because, like, isn't Minnesota known as, like, the land of 10,000 lakes? So... I mean, it would be one thing if it was like that, but... A lake as huge as Lake Michigan? That don't make any sense, man. That just doesn't make any sense. Push on the federal front so we can get actually win there. If we take Milwaukee, I think I think it's over for them. There we go. Milwaukee's ours, but... Do we actually get a peace deal against them? No. Ball of re okay. Let's see. How, how? 60, 68? Oh god, they have to capitulate these guys. I wonder if we could do just a general attack against these guys. Oh, it's time to do these, these guys anyways. Push in. It's time for these guys to go bye bye. Now, I'm sure, yeah, they've had enough time to core all this land, so. Which really sucks. I already probably should have been pushing into them, but whatever. Oh, uh, there's a lot of rivers around here, too. Can you guys actually go this way? No, you can't. That's good. Help out. Good, good, good. Not bad, not bad. Yeah, I mean, it's just kind of stupid with these guys over here. I don't want to attack over a river. Blueprint ceiling, that's fine. Radio inception groups, that's fine. Nothing over there I really care about. We'll probably go and do limited exports just because we are lacking a couple goods here and there, so. Okay, these guys are looking really bad now. Which I'm, I'm thankful for, but. Whatever. I mean, these guys are cut off anyway, so. If that's a case, you guys can probably all just do this. Go ahead and go down there. Oh, wait. Oh, that's going to screw you up here, too. Eh, whatever. I don't really care at this point. Kill them off. Just get rid of them. Ay, ay, ay. Well, I guess it does make the CSA a little bit stronger over here, but still. I'm going to assume... That the federal government kept attacking the CSA or something. They said like 100,000 manpower, 125,000 manpower before we, you know, went off screen so I could take a little break, but. Mm. Mm -mm. I really wonder if we could do a general attack. You know what? You guys go attack right there. 
You'll probably be okay. You'll probably be okay. Help him out. Now about some buddies. Uh, they got some light tanks there. I really don't want to take over river, so we'll do it like this. Then you'll take over river. There you go. I mean, the stockpile is looking great, except for support equipment. I mean, we've just been, like, waiting, trying to get more soldiers in, do a lot of good stuff. At this point, though, I'm going to duplicate you guys, and we're going to go make these 40, 40 combat widths. Bad. Can I convert these three? Actually, I think these divisions will be deleted when we're done here. So maybe we shouldn't do stuff like that. Uh, how is our Air Force doing down here? It's actually doing kind of okay. Alright, come over here then. Help on out. Come on out. Ooh, they're doing damage over here too. That's not good. 78. Well, we do have air superiority over here, so we should be able to win, right? Where are you guys at? You're up here. You guys can be converted to 40s. Advanced fire bases. And. Shock and all. Good. At this point, we might be able to try general attack. Can we try general attack and do well, maybe? Well, we're not right there, apparently. But if you guys helped out, you actually would be able to win. Down here. I mean, we're still trying to attack down here, too, so. Keep those tanks busy. Keep them busy, boys. See what we can do. We got enough manpower and supplies that I feel fairly confident in this attack, actually. What's so you guys? You're over here. It, you know it's bad when it's easier to take out the PSA than the actual federal government. Oof. And the CSA still exists, but, you know, whatever. Black cruiser development. Not bad, not bad. I haven't done any other focuses except for the Air Force and Naval stuff, so this stuff that we can still all do. Christian work ethic wouldn't be too bad to do. Let's do that one. With the advent of a new nation, there begins a split in work ethic across the nation that the old Democrat radicals did not intend. Across the nation, there's a failure of morality as work and dancing engaged in on the Sabbath, and liquor continues to persist. Immorality will be stomped out. Now, you guys are going to win. Or are you going to die trying? Well, we're winning in some places, some places, not so much. Madison will be ours, hopefully. Yeah, definitely in the Wisconsin area, that's not too bad. Even Iowa's looking pretty good. As we go further and further south, it's looking a little tenuous a bit, at best. Um, anything over here? Infantry, expert, good. Yeah, definitely with the AUS, or the American Union State and the CSA piecing out, like, not having a war... Really hurt me. Really hurt us. Good. Three forty seven divisions. There goes Somalia, I guess. Yeah, they got all militia. A lot of militia, that's fine, whatever, don't really care. Ooh, yes. Um I should have done this one. Win it weaken the Minutemen or whoever. I don't really care at this point. Better artillery? It is 1940. What do you expect, you know? Um, we'll grab this one. That'll be good. Even more soft attack from our artillery. We should be able to just shell the living hell out of the PSA now. And we can see they have 71 divisions, huh? Not bad. I don't care. We're actually doing pretty well in Oklahoma. We might get Wisconsin soon. Protect the Red Guard cells. Are we out of guns yet? Not yet. We actually have 33,000 guns. Holy cow. Uh, guys, I recommend you all go and do that. Thank you. And actually, we had some people over here. Where are the planes? We had actually 100 planes around here that I put in the steel belt. I don't think it was all four of you, but maybe I was wrong. Ooh, the ship, not bad. More divisions, liberty, and tough hombres, and such like that. Can't do that yet. We'll have the two militia divisions from Kansas. Get the stuff from Wisconsin, that'd be good. Okay, we can't get the ones from Kansas. Okay, there are no Kansas divisions. Alright, whatever. Oof. Incredibly bloody war. 
guys at? You're just not doing anything, are you? Reform your line. Okay, seriously, who designed these great lakes? You know, borders. That doesn't make any sense. <laughs> what, what, what is this? Look at this. What the heck is that? <laughs> oh, we're in, in Illinois, great, but I don't understand that. We're going to keep focusing on the, more of the Midwest than the South for now. All right, give them a few days. Uh, we're just going to keep focusing, yeah, like I said, on these guys. Give them some time, get a little more orderly. You know, let them get a little bit more planning, and then we'll try another general tech. I know I said, like, I don't want this video going too long, but I had to cut out some of it just because it just, I can't do it for that long. And the PSA is not going to hold out for that long. Let's be realistic. We just killed off another 100,000 of them, and another 100,000 of us, so. And I can't imagine them keeping this up. They've got 23,000 manpower left. You know it's bad when I can't even take out the federal government compared to this, the PSA. Like, they went, they did all this stuff. They got all these cores, and it still ain't enough. Oh, my goodness. All right, we'll do this. Cool. Christian work ethic, and we're going to grab white welfare. First order is to determine who is a true national citizen and deserving of aid in our nation. If they can trace their ancestry to native blood, then the NDWL will receive state grants so that they may give direct aid to those who most need most needy within our group, grouping, such as recent widows or recently unemployed. Oh, whatever. Alright. Oh, oh, nice. Alright, you guys looking pretty good. Go ahead when you can. Alright, everyone help out. Here we go. That's going to be a slaughter to California, but that doesn't matter. It has to happen. And you're going to force the attack. I don't I, I don't really care at this point. Oh, are they Poconos or something? Oh, Oklahoma's got more divisions. Federal operative captured. Ah, uh, Kenneth Bennett. We have made ways of making you talk. I don't care how many casualties it takes. It's so dumb that the CSA just still lives. It just continues living, 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 living. It makes no sense. Oh, they can lose pretty much the entire Midwest and still hold on. What a shame. But the Midwest is looking great now. Machine government, good. Push against... Oh, yeah, well. I guess we got to save up some more command power so we can do uh, against Pacific Front, because that's, that's pretty much it. And we should have enough command power soon. There you go. Maybe need a few more guns, that's fine. Grab some more of that. Order store to Michigan, great. Michigan, what a weird little state. Take whatever we can use right now. Iowa. Edward abandons the throne. I can't imagine that the PSA still has any more manpower left after this. 70 divisions left. New nationalism? Yeah, they're out. They're on service by requirement, so... They could be mobilizing, for all we know, but... I would not want to be them right now. You guys are all 20 combat widths? No. 40s. Even thicker. Machine system decryption. That's good. Keep doing that. Yeah, the center the center's falling apart. Texas is not looking great for us, but it's not looking too bad. We've got Houston back, which is nice. Ooh, northern Texas, that'd be good. I mean, look at that. That's so bad for those Marines, but, you know, they chose that path. Still out of manpower. Export focus. They lost another division. That's awesome. Northern Texas will be ours. Some machine guns. It's 1940. Let's grab some of this. More defense and breakthrough. It's very, very nice. Still building more roads, which actually be really good for us once the Civil War is over, but this has lasted way too long. But I'm really glad that the, the, what, the Black Belt didn't pop up yet. That would have been very bad for us. Hey, look. An encirclement. They'll be gone soon enough. Good, good, good. 
Yep, Texas. We're suffering here a little bit more in Texas. Whatever. I mean, they can't keep up the losses. I mean, we've lost a million so far, but that's between three enemy nations, so... Whatever. Yeah, their divisions look god-awful. What are their stockpiles like, actually? Oh, they got some... What is that? Is that artillery? Yeah, it's artillery. That's artillery. They got plenty of guns. They got some motorized. They've got some planes as well. Not bad for them. Alright, so we got Texas here. I'll put you guys like all... You know, I want to do it like this. You two go like there. And then you two go right, right there or something. Cool. Welfare of a white kind. And then we'll do some battle, battle cruiser research. Eh, okay, why not? Battle cruisers present a middle balance between heavy battleships and faster cruisers. We should ensure that we have some in our navy. Not the most inspiring um, focus, but we'll take it. At this point, they have 62 divisions left. They're still trying to attack me here, huh? Alright, well, go ahead. Go ahead. Go ahead. Yeah, you're not allowed to lose, son. Not allowed to lose, Jeb. Not allowed to lose. Are oh, they helping out? You might as well help them out, too. Why not? Especially if they have no manpower. So Texas is giving us more trouble. We've already broken all of the way to eastern Colorado. That's nice. Getting a little better. Manpower is quickly being drained. But, hey, you attack us, we attack you right back. Less than 60 divisions? Yes, they do. Oh, we actually got southern Texas off. Nice job, guys. Especially their stupid little tanks there, huh? Oh, man, it's going to take forever to process this video. Oof. Good. Die, you pieces of garbage. But thank you for taking out the CSA. I mean, without them, we would we might have been able to collapse, actually. We, we might have collapsed just because the CSA was doing really well. Order store in northern Texas is great. But, man, my God. I don't know why Huey Long was just so focused on taking us out so harshly in Louisiana. Like, yeah, I know that's supposed to be where his base of operations is, but... That was just ridiculous. Absolutely ridiculous. Just constant attacks where I couldn't even use my motorized. Alright, so they've left probably about 50 ish divisions. Uh, are we still attacking here? Are we still doing stuff? We lost that battle. How am I not surprised? Jeb is pathetic as a leader. Come on, Jeb. Come on, Jeb. I gave you an extra amount of divisions. You still can't take this? Hmm. Big sad. Oh, are we missing guns for realsies? Yes, we are. Alright. Pump it back up to, eh, go up to 10. That'll help out with some tungsten issues. But I'm not going to give up the fight. Nope. We're going to keep on attacking forward, forward, forward. Level 6 now. Not bad. Oh, well, it's becoming more of a skilled staffer, which is good. Charismatic. Ah, oh, let's go with charismatic. Why not? Simon, infantry expert. That's what I thought. And Patton. Well, he's, just, he's doing Patton things. Pierre, not bad. Minnesota? Why not? Come on. Cancel unlease. Miniman crush. Look at that. Miniman are finished. With the AFP's militia collapsing and their men either retreating or facing reprisals from our men, they are finished and our people can rest easy. This force of hooligans will no longer terrorize them. Supplies can move with ease. And soldiers have one less to worry about in their lives. It's very good. Come on, guys. You don't want to be disappointing to your families, do you? Quota act, huh? Well, this looks like everything's been more condensed, which is kind of nice, actually. Hmm. Still no manpower, which is good to see. Government staff for schools. Shock and awe. Even more damage? Yes, please. Uh, it's still 1940. And get some better tanks, maybe? I mean, we might use them eventually, maybe. Minnesota divisions. Head on over here. That'd be fine. Colorado divisions. Not bad. Hmm. 
Now we're heading towards the Rockies, which is not good, but whatever. Alright, so we've lost probably 1.1 million. I mean, that's not bad. We've killed off so many of them, though. There we go. Good. And all but you go here, too. There you go. Closing in on Washington, D.C. And CSA might be the last group we need to take out, actually. Battle cruiser research. Nice. Let's go with naval aviation next. Naval aviation is the future of warfare on the high seas. We should ensure that our air designs are capable of being launched from carriers and destroying the enemy fleet without even endangering our own. Good. Very good. And we cut these guys off, too. Great. Yeah. The Second American Civil War, like in Kaiserreich, is always can always be difficult. I should really play as the CSA again, just like stomp everybody. Like apparently the CSA always wins in a lot of other people's campaigns. Maybe not always, but for a fair amount they win quite often. So at least that's what I hear from other people. What? What the hell? Um, I don't give a crap about your military access, son. Why did you pop up? You have no divisions there. That doesn't make any sense. Followed. Oh. Is Poland actually killing everyone there? Hold, hold on. Poland! Poland! How? What the? How is Poland single handedly destroying the Austrian Empire? <laughs> this is such a weird game. Uh, let's see. Power projection, that's not bad. I like this one, though. Uh, we'll go with that one, just because we, already, we don't have any carriers right now. Maybe we'll switch it later on, but not yet. Uh, oh, yeah, we've been losing a few divisions, too, apparently. But well, we're not going to give up. Nope. I don't care what it takes. Any manpower loss doesn't matter to me. What matters is we completely destroy the PSA. Food stamps? Oh, they, got, oh, they are mobilizing. Oh, they went to service bar. All don't serve. Wow. Come on, Edward. El Paso, come on, take this area. Oh, now they're doing... Um, Austria's fallen. Whoa, that is... Huh. Oil restored in Virginia, that's nice. Now they're all falling into the Reich's back. That's a big Belgrade pocket. Wow, look at that. Serbia's thick as heck. And now they're fighting Austria again. Why would you why would you peace out like that? That makes no sense. Now they're just gonna be fighting them again, so like you, you solve nothing, guys. You solve nothing. And that's the case over here, we're gonna come up here now. Can you guys actually win maybe? I, I you know what? I, I don't trust them. I really don't trust my army over here. You still have to manually control it because they're a bunch of ding dongs over there. Oh, did you guys die over here too? Nice. Good. Keep killing them. They have less than 30 divisions. I'm going to end this campaign, or end this episode, actually, not the campaign. This episode once the PSA is dead. Oh, it's going to take forever to process this one. Come on. We're so close at this point. We're, we're, we're pretty darn close, I'd say. Wow, we're missing so many guns? Doesn't matter. I don't care what the cost is for guns. We can just build more military factories anyways. Oh, look at that. Oh, we sunk 10 enemy destroyers. That's what you get for sinking five of our destroyers earlier, America. Or, you know, the federal government. Oh, look at that. Another destroyer. Or, destroyers. Division destroyed. Oh my gosh. Where are you guys at? I mean, it's getting pretty bad about this stuff over here. I'm going to throw these back over here. Southern Texas is finally ours. Oh, God, just... Hey, <sighs> come on, just kill them off. Dockyards? We actually have dockyards? We do have some naval XP, so maybe I don't mind doing this. Eh, no radar, that's fine, whatever. Anti-air is pretty basic. Grab some deck armor, I always like grabbing some of that. 
Some of that. And a half adequate carrier, so that's not bad. Half adequate, half adequate. Some Trab al Baidan has capitulated, who cares? We lost one destroyer in exchange for three armored recruits. Oh, wow, that's a big. Oh, wow. That's actually pretty impressive. We probably lost quite a few ships. Fall of Warsaw? No, we. Oh, hmm. I did upgrade this guy a little bit more. He's Lone Wolf, Smoke Tune Expert, so. Flanders has capitulated. Alright, alright. Go home, guys, go home. Order stored in Oklahoma, very good. Well, there goes Poland. Wow, Austria. The Austrian Empire lost to Poland. Then they peaced out. Then they joined the Reichs Pact. Go back to war with Poland. Germany takes out Poland and now gets Galicia Lodomeria. That is such a move. Wow. What's going on? Oh, they're probably releasing Poland. That's what's up. 1940, come on. Oh, let's go and do this because we need synthetic refineries. My biggest gripe with Kaiser Reich. It's just so laggy. Sometimes. We have aviation. New admirals. Marines. Dockyards, why not? Our dockyards are somewhat inadequate to fight a war on, the, on their own. We need to ensure that the new naval production facilities are constructed to support the war effort. Alright, let's go and reorganize the guys first then. I will. I know this video is long, but oh my god, I don't care. I don't care what happens. I'm glad I cut out that other section it's because it was. It took me like an extra half hour to do. So, all right, it doesn't look like anything's going on, so you might as well just go on ahead. I don't care about supply problems. I really, really don't give a gosh darn about them. Trans Pecos. Netherlands is gone. I mean, we built up a lot of infrastructure here. Holy cow. It's a good thing we got a lot of steel for this, though. Because, my goodness, we're going to need a lot of military factories. Keep the pressure up on them. They have less than 30 divisions. They've got a little bit of manpower left, but they've got to be hurting like crap all, all over the place. Um, You probably can't help out you guys too well, huh? Guess we get no more bombers in reserve, huh? Actually, we should have some casts, too, we should be able to use. Oh, we're breaking through Arizona, that's good. Just go straight for San Diego. Come on, go, 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 go. Our guys are looking so bad. We've lost so many people doing this stuff. Oh, my goodness. Oh, there's a river here, huh? I don't care. I really don't. Alright, let's see. We can maybe attack here next, maybe? Maybe not? What if we did that? Push on the Federalist front. That is so gosh darn pathetic that I'm ashamed that, the, that I call these my divisions. Wow. That looks so bad. Tw Come on, guys. Seriously? Oh, hold on. This might shake it up a little bit more. Less, more breakthrough for us. 15% more breakthrough. We might be able to actually get over here then. No, I, I don't even care at this point. We're going to lose so much manpower because of this, but it doesn't matter. I, it doesn't matter at all. You lose some division, so be it. Whatever. I can't really be concerned about it. Come on, break over for the love of God. Break. Break them. I mean, this says we have red air, but there's no planes in the air. Super close to breaking this area over here. Level 7 on defense. Oh, yeah, look at that. Half strength, good. Come on, come on, come on. There we go. Up out right here. Take the capital. They're almost stacked on every single front, which is super nice. Help out, help out. 
I could force the attack, I would. I was just looking over here. It's still, still going, but we've broken into California, which is really nice. Take LA, take LA. Oh, man. What is this? Oh, okay. That's kind of cool. Sure, why not? And 1940. Grab some nuclear attack. Because we can. I don't care how many men we lose. Good. Extreme brutal fighting. Lots of losses on our side, but you know what? It'll all be worth it in the end. Oh, come on. We've almost got them. We've almost got them. Oh, Washington is ours. Thank God. Everyone, just help attack here. So, where's their capital now? Do I have to invade San Juan? Oh my goodness, seriously? It's not, it's not even a core. I have to cut San Diego off, that's nice. Hey, CSA, oh god, don't tell me the CSA is going to be the last nation we got to take out here. Last faction, I should really say. Harrisburg will, need, will be pretty important to take out. And... Baltimore, come on. Come on, Balti. There you go. Probably Harrisburg. Thank God. No one's going to get anything from these people except me. The CSA had their chance to take stuff, but they took too long. Just go on ahead in. There you go. Well, I'm glad they're dead. Thank goodness. Hey, that idea expired. That's fine with me. Go and do that. Santa Cruz front. Might as well. All we needed to win the war was the Pacific states to go from California all the way to Iowa and Wisconsin to help push in the CSA. Whew. Let's see, nothing on the right side there. And then, anything on the left side I really care about? I really don't care if we let time go on too much. As you can tell, I don't really care. Uh, let's see, new admirals. Many admirals, admirals deserted to the traders to the east. We should train a new generation of naval leaders to ensure our continued maritime dominance. Don't care about the losses. Don't care one single bit. Beta Puerto Rico. Uh, no. Why would why would I give them independence? What? Now the CSA probably still has a few million manpower, air production. Oh, actually, that's better than before. With them struggling against the Feds, was probably a good thing for us. All right, so we should have be making some carrier hulls. Well, obviously we're not. Uh, South Carolina class. Is there any upgrades we could throw on here actually instead? No radar. I should really do some radar, but we got some other stuff we gotta take care of first. Get some more anti air and aircraft stuff. I like that aircraft stuff. And I got two of them, that's fine. Make only one. Boom, boom, boom. Good. So I do apologize for how long this video is. It just... Sometimes you just gotta move through the campaigns a little bit faster. It's almost 1941. Jesus Christ, this Civil War's been going on for like four years already. Or it will have lasted a total of four years. Or so. Now next up will be Canada, because they illegally took New England, so... If I had to go to war immediately, so be it. Ooh, you actually William Shepard, your level... You got the one that gives you six more slots for divisions. Nice. Oh, we've lost not seven divisions here, maybe? I don't know. PSA. Okay, at this point, if so if we're this deep into the PSA, they honestly should have just given up by now, but whatever. Hey, take Navarro. Or, that's relatively close to Navarro. Oh, we got Philadelphia. Great. Great, 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 great. You keep attacking them. I know this is extremely deadly for our soldiers, and they're dying like crazy, but they've lost hundreds of thousands of soldiers. Nice. Very good. Actually, just gonna take Dover. What is it? Was this Maryland or Delaware? Oh, Delmarva. What the heck is a Delmarva? Trenton, come on. Not bad. Another convoy sunk. That's good. Oh, we got him. Collapse of the American syndicalists. Right? Well, why, why do they say that now when they're not done yet? 
Pennsylvania. Cool, thank you. Guys, come on. Let's go, let's go, let's go. Absolutely overwhelming numbers to help and try to just destroy everyone around here. Oh, look, we're doing better on fuel. So California's taking forever to take out, though, for some reason. Nice. CSA sub. Cancel loan lease. Yeah, I can't imagine they're doing too well down there. Guys, wh why are you taking so long? This doesn't make any sense. Take the Black Legion and come to Portland. They literally have only 3,000 manpower left. Uh, it's not even that these guys are tough. They just don't want to move sometimes. Mm, we're slowly getting up here. Slowly crawling our way up here. Force it. I don't care what happens. wallonia has gone. Germany's dying. Force the attack. What was going on over here? Oh, something happened. Germany's not looking too good. Oh, my goodness. That Poland was released. Spain's still having the Civil War, too, so... Oh, New York's all these all oh, they've all been cut off. That is so good. All fifty some divisions, thirty some divisions. Nice. Oh, they're gonna die like the dogs they are. Sacramento would be nice too though. Come on. Come on. Give up, you bunch of anarchists. Getting to New York City is going to be a little, pretty tough, but that's alright. we got a lot of army XP, though. We've lost... Uh, how many casualties would you say America's lost so far? I'd say maybe 10 million people, if you include civilians. Probably probably around 10 million. Stuart, good. Captain Lee, thank you. It's almost 41. Oh my goodness, this is so deadly. Even their Central American allies. Which I, oh no, no, that's Argentina. Even Argentina is going to be dying here, too. Nice. We're making those, but I never even use the light tanks. Joyzy? We'll get them done soon. Expand the waves. Or waves. Women can serve many auxiliary roles in the Navy, freeing up men for combat duty. While this might be socially controversial, it will be significantly, or it will significantly help the war effort. That'll be good. There we go. The PSA is dead. Thank God for the PSA. Oh, wow, that's really disgusting. Uh, and you see, all, this is all the territory I gave them with the American Union State. I gave them all this, including Trans Pecos, but I don't know why. Oh, whatever. I, and I'd be honest, I did only want one video for us to take out pretty much all the American sections as well. Just because I don't want to have to deal with this later on, too. So, there we go. Oh, my goodness. Alright, you know what, how to deal with these people? With a lot of love. That's right, with a lot of love. Attack him from behind. Come on. Just just die now. You have 18 more divisions? No, they, they're running out. Come on, come on. I mean, I guess technically, if the Black Belt did re revolt right now, we, we would do okay. German Empire, yeah, I can understand why they canceled Unleash. Cool. We've lost a lot of guys. Holy crap. Hey, we're doing a lot better on guns, though. You know what? Can I get manpower back if I delete these? Yeah, I can. Thanks. Normally, can't do that in normal Kaiserreich. Seriously. Like, they're literally fighting the last man. So be it. So be it. Alright, everyone. Head to New York City. Time to go. Make sure you get your planes over here, too. Um... Oh, yeah. Do we have any more cast, maybe? Federalists are cheap. Federalists seem to 
seem to believe they can no longer do major damage as they've been increasingly caught attempting to flee our nation for friendlier factions and their propaganda attempts to peter it out. With their last vital cells having collapsed, they are gaining virtually no re new recruits and the counter operations are long last over. Thank goodness. Any new divisions? Give me that manpower because we've lost too many men already. New York City's going to fall. Come on. Go all the way over there. All the way. He was joining the Rikes pack. Well, I'm not sure how much they're going to help out, but you know, whatever. Come on. Don't give me this crap that they're about. That they're, we can't win here. Come on. Oh my goodness. Seriously? Duplicate it some more. We need more damage. Oh my gosh. Are you kidding me? This is why the federal government was so bad. Like, seriously. They had all this time to do stuff. And yet, they still couldn't take New York City. Uh, I'm just going to delete these divisions. I want that manpower back. We need them. We need it. So. I mean, it's not bad for us. Still gives more. I guess technically we don't need any more Eric's Beast. Technically so. Oh, oh, these are fighters. I thought these were casts. Oh, uh, we have some naval bombers. Or, you know, normal bombers too. Oh, you're not winning. You have no bombers. There you go. Now that should help us push it over a little bit more. Central American Republic, please give up. Please stop this. Come on, guys. At least they gave up. That's good. If you're still watching this episode, I appreciate you watching. I really do. Ethiopia. First Division broken. Expand the wave. Do some liberty ships as well. Our shipyards, previously dedicated to commercial shipping, can easily be converted to produce massive numbers of convoys to supply our allies around the world. Which will, which will be a good thing. We're doing a lot better on guns, and artillery, and support equipment. Even motorized. Okay, it's going up slowly. We're getting there. Ships, ships, ships. There you go, make them two. There you go. Now we're operating at full capacity. Oh my god, guys, seriously. You know, I'll see you in just a little bit. I'm going to do this just and not waste any more time. All right, everyone, and we finally, finally have at the end of this very long video the end of the Second American Civil War. The South has indeed risen again, but this time so has the rest of the nation against those who would subdue us. The twin leftist threats of Long and Reed have been crushed as the bank traders align with the old government. These threats to the American way of life have been destroyed, and now it's time to reset what was once wrong and rebuild the nation as it was meant to be. You do the political math, aftermath of the Civil War and economic aftermath, and this took forever trying to kill these guys off over there, but my goodness, at least it's over. Let's get the radar development done, and that was, let's see, let me show you guys. That, if you want to read by the description, it's pretty quick. And then I believe I also did Liberty Ships as well, so not too bad. But my goodness, the American Civil War, just sometimes it takes too long. I know some people are going to say, use some tanks, use other stuff. I want to use artillery, but a seven-way Civil War, oh my goodness. Yeah, was it really one, two, three, four, five, six, six-ish, really, Civil War? Wait, well, you know, whatever. And let's go ahead and do, we can take the fight abroad, which wouldn't be bad. Germany has already collapsed. We should have seen all the lag. Back on the world stage, we could do that. And we're going to keep doing some of this stuff as well, but... Is there anything on the left side here? No? Old blood and guts. I would be an authoritarian Democrat. Picking a vice president, huh? The Lone Eagle. Interesting. The People's Senator. Social Conservatives, huh? Interesting. New Democrats, I guess. The Covenant. We got to do all this stuff. The American Emperor. Rebuilding the country? Time to do that. Alone. Long struggle to push through the Federalist and Syndicalist forces in America has left the victorious Union state economically drained. The hand that unifies the country can either promote deficit spending or... Regime or an austere policy that directs limited 
or that limits direct intervention in the market. But I hope you enjoyed today's episode. It was my god along when I got to get a little break here. But if you enjoyed it, please consider leaving a like, subscribe if you're new, check out my Discord link in the description below, and I will see you tomorrow once we probably see, well, the rest of the Reichspact collapse. Thanks for watching. Have a great rest of your day.